That assassination attempt. COVID diagnosis for the Republican National Convention. Global IT glitch. We are learning some new details today about law enforcement's response to the assassination attempt on Donald Trump. We continue to hear that former President Trump is in good spirits. A local officer actually came face to face with that suspect. At that point, the officer's hanging on yes. to the side of the roof? Yes. Trump's classified documents case has been dismissed. Senator Bob Menendez from New Jersey has been found guilty on all 16 charges. President Biden speaking one-on-one -on -one with NBC's Lester Holt. Yeah, the term is bullseye. It was, a, it was a mistake to use the word. I didn't, I didn't say crosshairs. I meant bullseye. I meant focus on him. Focus on what he's doing. President Biden, who is now isolating at his home in Delaware after he tested positive for COVID. Pressure campaign among Democrats calling for the president to step aside. The Republican National Convention kicks off in Milwaukee. Well, the former president has really enjoyed the drama and the tease here, extending his veep stakes. This is where everything is happening. Donald Trump officially became the party's presidential nominee. Trump also made headlines choosing Ohio Senator J.D. Vance as his running mate. Massive out crippling computers around the world. Everything from police stations, TV networks, and businesses. Some of them telling me it's been three to four hours that they had to wait. Thank you so much for joining us here on NBC News Daily.